Thanks for joining us. Emotional stories tonight shared by Kiwani County residents during a meeting about the state of their drinking water. They gathered tonight to hear the results of the most recent round of well testing, looking for nitrate levels and other possibly dangerous elements previously discovered in their water. It's a story we've been following now for well over a year. New attend Holly Brantley was at the meeting and has the details. But everybody in this room tonight better remember, we don't have clean water in this community for our children. I don't feel we live in a third world country. I think clean water is right. People who live in Kiwani County speaking out at the Land and Water Committee meeting about the condition of their drinking water. Many here expressing frustration over hardships, issues some say they've dealt with for years. We have test results going back almost 20 years where our townships have 28, 32, 34, 38 percent unfit wells. That's a huge problem, and you're talking two decades have taken place, and we still can't get clean water into our homes, into our daycares, and protect our children. Most recently, 300 private wells were tested in October. Kevin Mazarek with the UW Center for Watershed Science explained some wells still show levels of nitrate over 10 parts per million. He says it's hard to say if overall the levels of nitrates are up or down on average and could take years to see significant change. Wisconsin's Department of Health Services says drinking water with any amount of nitrate over 10 parts per million can cause health issues like birth defects, blue baby disease, and thyroid disease. Committee member Tim Kennard explained they are are searching for solutions, saying most recently the county applied for a grant for a municipal water supply and was denied. The village of Caskell has tried. We are looking at options to try to do this. People called on the committee to continue to look for ways to move forward. So I guess what I want to see is what is the remedy? We keep testing over and over again and we are more than willing to do it, but we want to see something happen beyond that. Water experts say for now they are encouraging people to take steps to improve their own wells. In Kiwani County, Holly Brantley, Action 2 News.